Thanks for joining our presentation. Today we will share our work, Learning Probability Box Embeddings for Effective and Efficient Ranking. First, we will start with the background of our paper about the task of information retrieval and ranking. The goal of IR is to matching queries and candidates' objects with relevance. We give the matching result, that is, compute a relevance score between the queries and object, and sort the core scores to return a ranking list. A popular paradise is to uh, compute such relevance score based on the representation of queries and objects. For example, in textual ranking task, a sparse back of words models is well known, such as uh, TF-IDF and uh, BM25. Recently, researchers proposed to utilize uh, deep learning approaches and encode queries and items to dense vector embeddings. The relevance is estimated by the distance or inner products between the dense vector of queries and items. However, dense retrieval may have some potential shortages. For effective effectiveness, vector equals to a single point in the embedding space, and it might be suboptimal to model the semantic diversity and uncertainty of queries and items. For efficiency, the exact nearest search is time causing for a large corpus, while approximated nearest neighbor search can speed up the searching process with the sacrifice of accuracy. Fig one shows an example in recommendation where the queries and items correspond to user preference and product respectively. From this figure, we can see that a user may have some acceptable ranges of price and style for the products, and the product may also be associated with the price fluctuation and seller styles due to its versatile attributes. The user usually chooses a product based on the partition matching of her preference and item's attributes. Similarly, uh, for ad hoc search, the short queries may be ambiguous and be relevant to several subtopics. A uh, document may cover diverse topics and thus be relevant to the queries with disparate information needs. It is hard to model semantic diversity and uncertainty of queries and items with a single point in the vector space. Recently, probability box embeddings a typical variant of geometric inspired embedding models are proposed, and it demonstrates the ability to model hierarchical and uh, transitive uh, relations, entanglement, and uh, uncertainty. It represents objects to a multi dimensional X aligned uh, hyperrectangles. Based on box embeddings, we will show that how to provide re relative improvement in effectiveness and efficiency. We believe that it can improve effectiveness and efficiency for ranking tasks. For effectiveness, uh, from the example shown in Figure 1, we can see that after mapping the queries and items to box representation, box embeddings can naturally model the semantic diversity and uncertainty of queries and items. The volume of the overlapping box between query box and item box can be used as a similarity measures for the queries and items. For efficiency, as shown in Figure 1, we can easily judge whether a query box and an item box have overlap in space. If two boxes are disjoint with each other, it means that they are not relevant. We can use this property to efficient field filter and invariance items. So we propose to use the box embeddings to improve the ranking task. For effectiveness, the representation ability can be used to better model the semantic diversity and uncertainty. Besides the similarity measures, which is the volume of the OLATIN box, is proved as a kernel function. Uh, for efficiency, 
we proposed a box embedding based indexing method, which can filter in relevant items, reduce the visiting time. We can also optimize the ranking task with efficient ori oriented uh, constraints. It can increase the filtering proportion of uh, in relevant items. We give some preliminaries. Box embedding represents objects as a d-dimensional box. The box can be parameterized with two vectors, which corresponding to its lower and upper boundaries. We can compute its volumes by using the product of d-dimensional interval lenses. For pairwise the relation, give two objects A and B, they are embedded to two boxes. The overlapping region between them is still a box, and the boundaries of the overlapping box can be calculated as the following formula. If two boxes are disjoint, there always exists a dimension that the computed lower bound can be larger than the upper bound. Noticing that the upper bound of overlapping box may be smaller than lower bound but the volume is always now negative. Uh, we calculate the volume of the overlapping box Fs below. Now we introduce the optimization of box embedding. Recently, Gumbel box is proposed. Uh, it used Gumbel box distribution to sample and uh, generate box parameters, make all parameters to involve the gradient updating. By computing the expectation of Gumbel distribution, the final estimation of the bounds of overlapping box can be obtained, and the volume is calculated based on the estimated boundaries. Now we begin to introduce our methodology in ranking task. In definition, give a set of queries Q and a set of items I and uh, a relevant item subset for each query. We can give the box representation of queries and items and measure the relevance by Gumbel box. For training, the ranking loss is decided to rank the positive items higher than the negative items. We optimize the ranking task by pairwise objective. And at a volume regularization, we penalize the volumes of boxes when they become greater than a fixed fixed values, and uh, uh, it can give a reasonable bound, bound for the measure of uncertainty. Through box representation, we can easily judge whether query box and item box have an overlapping region. If two boxes are disjoined with each other, indicating that uh, these items is irrelevant to the query. Therefore, we can use this property to safely filter in reference items. We designed the uh, overlapping constraints to better distinguish the positive items and negative items, and it can increase the proportion of in reference items. The constraints is described to make two boxes more likely to overlap or disjoin. Equally, we can use the minimum of interval lengths in all dimensions to judge whether two boxes are overlap or disjoint. So we require the minimum of the interval lengths of positive pairs larger than zero, and the minimum of interval lengths of negative pairs smaller than zero. We use a margin loss to formalize the constraints, combine it with ranking loss, uh, volume regularization, and the overlapping constraints will give the final training loss. After learning box embeddings of all queries and items, we introduced our box embedding based indexing and searching methods. First, we give the analysis about the overlap probability in each dimension. Under the assumption of independent random distribution, each dimension has the probability P to overlap. Considering all dimensions, we can obtain the relevant item set IQ. In Figure 2, we can find that the embedding size in learning process usually make P close to 1. It means that in single dimension, 
the items disjoined with the queries are the majority. Inspired by this finding, we can obtain the relevant items by filtering the irrelevant items in each dimension. For building index, as shown in Figure 3, there are two situations that two boxes are disjoint in one dimension. The lower bound of query box is larger than the upper bound of item box, or the upper bound of query box is smaller than the lower bound of item box. So we sort the upper bound and the lower bound of all learned item boxes. Give a query which is mapping as a box. We begin to search the relevant items. First, we initialize a bit array b, which is valued by 1, and have a length uh, of i. Uh, b i equals to 1 indicates that item i have overlap with query q. Uh, for every dimension, we can use the boundaries of query box to search on the sorted boundaries of all item boxes. It will return to position uh, index, uh, index for filtering relevant items. After the binary search on all dimensions, the final irrelevant item sets are remanded. For each irrelevant item, we check the value of corresponding position in the bit array B and update the value to zero if the current value are one. Then we can visit the whole bit array to return the uh, relevant items IQ, which has the value one. After return a small set of relevant items, uh, we can infer the scores FQI through inputting the query box and each item box to our model. The final ranking list is produced according to the score. We also considered using uh, the special index method that supports range query. Uh, this method can find the geometry object efficiently and achieve a sublinear time uh, complexity. But existing spatial index usually suffer from the uh, curse of uh, dimensionality, and the search uh, efficiency can drop with the increase of dimension. We conduct experiments on two tasks of document ranking and recommendation to demonstrate the improvements in both effectiveness and efficiency. For passage retrieval, we use the corpus of MMS Markle. The experimental results are given in Table 1. For effectiveness, a box embedding based model achieved better uh, ranking performance than all vector embedding based models. We observed a little drop in recall. This is because that our box embedding model may filter some false negative uh, documents in searching stage. For efficiency, compared with dense retrieval model, we achieved the better average latency because we can filter a large proportion of invariant documents. For ablation study, we investigate the effect of uh, the overlapping constraints. Without the constraints, a large proportion of documents will not be filter filtered. Uh, it can result in a, a unacceptable latency. Uh, we also note that the constraints slightly improve the ranking performance. This is because the constraints can help model uh, better distinguish the positive and negative document. For recommendation task, we experiment with two datasets, Moonlands and Amazon Books. We report the top retrieval results on both the uh, 100 random sampled negative items and the four item sets. For effectiveness, uh, under the same baseline model, a uh, box embedding framework can enhance the ranking performance. Uh, and for simple models like DSSM, uh, our framework gained more uh, improvement. And for sequential models, we also observed a consistent uh, improvement in ranking performance. In conclusion, in this paper, we proposed to improve the effectiveness and efficiency for ranking task by incorporating the recently proposed box embeddings. For effectiveness, the box embedding can better represent the semantic diversity and uncertainty. 
The overlapping constraints are introduced to enhance the model to better distinguish the relevant and irrelevant items. For efficiency, box embedding based indexing methods are designed and it can filter the invariant items and reduce the, the uh, within ties uh, without losing the relevance accuracy in top retrieval results. 